Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3. Um, <laughs> badges challenge. Um, as you can probably tell, I am pretty sick uh, at the moment, so my voice may sound like poop. And I do apologize. Um, there's nothing I can really do about it, though. So after the last episode, I did go ahead and... I set him up for everything he needs to do um, for this one before we start our next bucket list item. Um, we have another really, really easy one, so I'm not really gonna. I'm not really gonna stress about getting it done right away. Um, once we get it done, you know, we're kind of just gonna end the episode, so I'm trying to hold off on that as well, obviously. Um, I do have some gifts that I need to get with him. So we'll be doing that, and, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Also, I want to apologize if you guys can hear the fan in the background, because, uh, I, like I said, I'm sick, so I'm, like, burning up, <laughs> even when it's not really that hot. Um, that's just how I am. Anyways, so we'll see how this goes. Um, he is right now headed over to the grocery store we're going to buy a lottery ticket because I want to um I want to get that wish knocked out of the way um nobody really told me where there's a TV in this town in the last episode in the comments so I guess we just continue waiting maybe we'll get one in the gifts and we'll be able to watch TV like that because I don't know any other way um but yeah so that's pretty much what we're up to right now and just uh, trying to figure everything out pretty much and like get ready for our next bucket list item which like I said it's a really easy one so I'm not too worried about getting it done right this millisecond it's kind of silly to do that but um, yeah I mean I do want to try and maybe make like a friend or something in one of the episodes I know he doesn't really have a wish for that but is it really going to hurt him? Probably not. Alright. So we've got our ticket. So I should get that. Well, we have to win the lotto, actually. So we're just going to buy one. If we don't win, then we'll have to keep buying. But for right now, I think that'll be good. We're going to go over to... <clears throat> excuse me. We're going to go over to the Palm Tree Bar. And we're going to get some food. Because we're kind of hungry. And it's already noon. So he needs to get something in him. Um... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I need a drink, I think. <coughs> Hold on a second. I got like a scratch in my throat, which is not helping. <sighs> Alright. Yeah, I think that fixed it. Alright, I want to meet these people. Give me a second, give me a second. I had to put the lid on my drink. Um... Dang, girl. All right. <clears throat> like I said, I want to be friendly and just pretty much try to meet quite a few people <clears throat> so we can be friendly with them. Are these the same people we interrupted before? Because I kind of feel like they are. And I feel like we're such bad people for doing that. Um, We'll give him a friendly introduction. This girl. I want to meet her. All right. Perfect. And this man is going to cook for us. Alright. And you should probably put your grease trap up, buddy. Just saying. Okay, all these celebrities hate us. <laughs> they literally hate us. They're like, why do you even talk to me, you freaking loser? So I was going to record this in full screen because I know when I click, it clicks like not where I'm clicking and it really bugs me personally. So I was going to... Uh, I was going to um, record in full screen so that that doesn't happen anymore, but if it, but it actually um, gets so dark when I put it in full screen that I hate it. Like I physically hate it. Not for me, but for like the recordings. Um, so I'm actually not recording in full screen until I can figure out a solution for that. I honestly don't know if there is one, but. I'm just saying, if you guys are noticing it, just 
please know that's why I haven't uh, stopped recording in small screen pretty much because it gets so freaking dark it's almost unbearable all right how much money do we have we have 931 okay so we can go ahead and we're gonna we're gonna serve the only thing we can serve chicken fried rice I mean, I could go for some Chinese. I'm not going to lie to you right now. It's been a really long time since this girl has had some Chinese. Thinking about it, I kind of want to ask for Chinese now. Because, well, I mean, not like ask, but like ask my significant other if they would like Chinese sometime soon. Because we haven't had it in like a million years. Um, I actually haven't had it since like August or October of last year. And that's no exaggeration. I'm being honest. Really haven't. Wow. All right. <laughs> that got real serious. But um, yeah, I love I love fried rice. Normally I get pork, but I mean I've never really had chicken. A lot of places here I don't think, like, actually I think it's you can either get pork or chicken. I just normally go with pork because it's what I'm used to. You know what I'm saying? But I'm sure I would love chicken fried rice. My favorite thing to get from Chinese though, if you guys are even curious while we just watch him cook um my favorite thing to get from chinese is beef and broccoli or general sal's chicken like those are my two favorite things so if you guys want to leave a comment of your guys' favorite i would be interested to know what qualities nice nice qualities boy all right greet that celebrity did you meet this man Yes, you did. Okay. Alright, you can give her a friendly introduction, or at least try, because it seems like everyone here doesn't even want to talk to us. We need to... I was looking through the list, um, for... I was looking for the li through the list of things that, like, we have to do and whatever. Um, yeah. There's actually quite a lot we actually have to do, so um, some of them I might end up doing more than one in an episode just because some of them are like need to kind of almost be done together, and you'll understand when I get there. Um, the next episode could be one of those. I'm just going through and setting this up. I don't know what he's up to. I normally just click everything. I still wish there was like a select doll button. <coughs> Excuse me. I hate coughing in your guy's ear. Um, I find it really disrespectful, but really there's nothing I can do about it. Like I said, there's like a scratchy feeling in my throat. When does the lottery end? Is it like five or is it seven? I can't remember. He's just kind of standing around like he doesn't have anything to do. I'm sorry. I should have set this up off camera. I'm really sorry. But I just figured while we were here and introducing ourselves, I had time and then we ended up not having time. All right. Well, nobody is going to eat the food we just spent money to make. Like, really, people? Come on. Don't waste a good bit of fried rice. Come on. I mean, that's how I feel anyways. Why waste the good food when you can literally get it for free? You know what I'm saying? Like, if someone offered me a whole thing, like a whole serving of pretty much of pork fried or chicken fried rice... I would be really excited to take it. This is probably really boring for you guys to watch, but... Alright, there we go. That's all I had to do. That was it. Alright, can you introduce yourself to her? I didn't think so. Okay, where are you at? Oh, you're in the bathroom. Why don't you go ahead and just use this real quick while we're here? It's hailing out. That's why I don't really want to want to go out yet. Um, so there's no TV here. Right? Because we're looking for another TV. Um, even upstairs, there's no TV. This lady's going to order something. That's so sweet. Alright. Have we met her? 
We have not. We're going to try. We're going to try and greet ourselves to the celebrity. It never ends well for me. Um, I don't know why. But the celebrities literally hate us in this game. So, <laughs> just to save, though. I wish, like, I could take this with me. Because that would be nice. I could put it in my fridge at home. <sighs> Alright, yeah. Unfortunately, they all hate us. Because we're not celebrities like them. So, whatever. Screw them. Moving on. Um... We could go try and find a way to make some money, because we do need, or he does have the wish to be, or have more than 5,000 simoleons. We don't even have 1,000, okay? How much did this cost us? Does this even cost us anything? Because I kind of really hope not now that people are, oh, it was free. Jeez, all right, never mind. <laughs> if I could make Chinese food for free in real life, um, you know it. I would be there. All right, let's just greet ourselves to these few last people. And then we're going to head out. <clears throat> we're going to go try and find a way to make some money in town. Because we really need to. And he's probably going to hate us as well. So, whatever. He can do that if he really wants to. I'm not going to worry about it. And we've already met these people, so I'm not even going to bother with it. It's such a bad day. Like, I don't even know where to take him to make money. Because I don't really want to be outside. Um... We could play for tips if we had a guitar. Ooh, you know what we could do? Is the consignment store closed? Um, I think it closes at 6. If it's not 6, it's 7, so it's about to close. Where is the consignment store? <laughs> I can't find anything, guys. <laughs> we need to get the um festival lot, too. I'm so mad that I forgot about it again. I always tell myself, oh, man, you forgot that. <laughs> and then I forget it for the next episode. Um, man, is this a garden? All right, we're going to the garden. I have an idea. I have an idea. Ooh. Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. We just got, like, a mother load for free. <laughs> Oh my god! We got it! With one ticket, we literally spent ten simoleons. He completed his lifetime wish. <laughs> Guys, we just completed our lifetime wish from winning the lottery. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> because we won 50,000. Oh my god, that's so cool. Whew. Okay. Well, we're still going to go over here to the garden because I still want to do this. Um, but we're going to lock in some more things. What does he want to do? Impress Gumpo? We can try. You want to buy a computer? Well, then before you go to the garden, where's Gumpo at? Um, it's a man. I know it is. I just, I gotta find where they are. He's not in the bathroom. Um... <sighs> Uh, is this him? That's Sharpo. Alright, right here. Um, well, first I think you have to try to present yourself to him. Or, like, introduce yourself to him. And then we can try other things. He's, like, all excited. Oh my god, that's too funny. I'm, I can't believe we just completed our lifetime wish as well. Oh my god, it's too funny. Well, that was easy. I thought this one was going to take us a while because we weren't going to get a job and that's why I chose it, but <laughs> jokes. Okay, I wanted to greet him. I don't know why you can't get to him. He's standing right in front of your face. Anyways. Alright, we're going to try to impress him. We're going to talk about our guitar skill. And then... We are going to talk about our occupation as nothing, because we don't have one, so never mind. We're going to talk about our wealth that we just earned through the lottery. <clears throat> we'll talk about our skill in, what else do we have a skill in? Science. And then we're going to talk to him about our skill in gardening. So, gardening. 
Alright, T, did it work? Ooh, one more, I think, and we'll have it. Just gonna... There we go. I can't believe he got his lifetime wish. That was really ridiculous. Literally, we've played him for three days. And now he wants to befriend him? I mean... We'll try and calm him down. Let's do our specials. Brighten his day. Um, we'll talk about computers with him. Maybe he's a computer whiz. I don't really know. We can... Enthuse about animals. Discuss our favorite TV shows. That's what I do in my free time. He's over emotional. That doesn't really help me much. Oh. What are these people over here doing? They're making a lot of noise. Is she actually eating what I made? I think a couple of people have eaten it. Well, thank you for not wasting it. Judy Rogers, I appreciate. <laughs> oh my god, my like, my nose is so clogged, I can hear myself and how bad I sound. I really apologize. Okay. <sighs> becoming friends with you is becoming very difficult, buddy. Um... Let's see, let's ask him about his age. Let's ask him about his career. We can ask him about his gender preference. I feel like I gotta sneeze now. Oh boy. Okay. Um, we can ask his sign, just because we can. He's grumpy, I kinda figured. Ask him about his alma mater. We'll ask if he's single. Not that I really care, but... We'll ask, just ask. We'll compliment him. Maybe he likes compliments. Though he is grumpy, so... <laughs> God only knows. He's only two days older than us. That's not bad. Alright, he's hungry. We're kind of keeping him from that. I think I'm just going to let him go. He seems unhappy right now with us and doesn't really want to talk. He wants to do his own thing. So we're going to actually go home for a second. And don't leave us here. Please take us with you. Oh, did it finally stop hailing? Because that was getting obnoxious. This game seems to be running a little bit slow right now. I don't really know why. Alright, I don't want to go all the way inside. I want to accept gifts. That's why I brought you home. Alright, so let's go ahead and accept some gifts. Oh, I was like, what is that? Never mind. Um, okay, I'm going to take the one from the bottoms. Bottoms? The bottom first. So the first one is from Brandon290396. It's a message from the game. I'm going to take it here. We just got an alarm clock. All right. Thank you so much. Let me go ahead and send you back a gift. So thanks for, if I could spell, for the alarm clock for Quentin in my badges LP alright and then you know me I'm gonna copy and paste it next one is from Nilo Sun 
It says, that's so amazing. You're very welcome. All right, well, I'm going to take this here. And we just got a chess set. Well, thank you so much for that. Um, not that we're really into building logic at the moment, but you never know. So thank you so much. Let me go ahead and send you back a gift. And instead of alarm clock, I can put chess table. The next one is from Abby2193. It says here is for your bucket list challenge. All right, I'm going to take it here. We just got 3,500 simoleons. Thank you so much. After we just won the lottery as well. <laughs> so thank you so much for that. And let me send you back a gift. Um, so it's 3,500. Alright. And I know you had sent all of the rest of yours for this challenge as well. Um, I am going to be doing another episode, probably like recording another one right after this. So I'm going to hold off on the rest of yours and I'll probably take them in the next one. But let me go ahead and take this one from Amethyst Princess. And it's the message from the game. I'm going to take it here. We just got the stereo. All right, we got a stereo. So thank you so much for that. I really appreciate it. I'm going to go ahead and send you back one as well. And put this here. We didn't get a TV yet, but that doesn't mean in the next episode we won't. So I'm going to put stereo. So there we go. All right, and that's where I've already taken one from Brandon, so I'm going to hold off on that as well. But thank you so very, very much for that. Um, all right, so what I'm going to do now is he actually wants to buy a computer. So I'm going to go ahead and just buy him a computer real quick and put it in the house. Um, he does have this one little tiny table in the kitchen, so I'm going to go ahead and just probably prop it up on that. I'm not going too fancy here. I'm not trying to spend all of his money uh, because I would like to see how much we can actually accumulate by the end of this. So I'm probably just going to him like a cheap one for right now. We can't put it facing. I can't go that way. Oh yeah, I can. Okay, there we go. So that should get that taken care of, and then he also wants to buy a hot tub, so I am going to do that for him as well. Um, does he have anything in here? Yeah, he does. Obviously, we just got all this stuff. Come on now. All right, let's put all this out. Here's his alarm clock. Um, I'll put his stereo in the living room, but let's see. Where should I put it? We'll put it there, and then this chess table. This house is so tiny. <laughs> Um, his chess table can go outside. Um, mm, we'll put it over here. It's kind of gaudy, but, you know, that's alright. <laughs> we need to move is what we need to do. Alright, and then the hot tub, I'm just going to go ahead and put it over here. So let's go ahead and buy one. They're under plumbing, miscellaneous. And I'm just going to buy the cheapest one there is. Not going to get too picky. Put it right there. And boom. Done. Alright, now he wants to go hot tubbing. That's actually easy to do. So, um, we will do that. But I want to... First, I want to... Go over here to the garden. So sorry. Um... Let's go ahead and head on over there. I probably sound like a huge mess, and I really do apologize. Oh, I'm zooming out instead of zooming in. All right, so we're just going to head on over here um, to the garden. Uh, we got to do our... We're going to do our bucket list item when we get here and then I want to just grab a few of the plants so that we have some food in our fridge um, because it's free and I don't have to pay for it um, the reason I was going to do it originally was because we didn't really have a lot of money and I was just like oh well this will be an easy way to get food okay so I'm pretty sure we can just click on him 
and we need to go streaking. So we're going to streak, and now that we're a celebrity, we're probably going to get scandalized, but we're going to do it. Um, so let's do it, buddy. <laughs> He's having so much fun just streaking, like, so funny. <laughs> he is too much. This game. <laughs> the sounds they make when they're streaking are too much. <laughs> we could catch the fireflies. I'm not really as worried about money anymore. <laughs> too much. It's funny though. Alright, there we go. So that is done and um, I'm just going to take a picture of the garden because I don't know how else we're going to take, how else we're going to have a picture that's going to represent this. Um, let's see, let's take a photo. And We'll take a picture of this. We'll remember the gazebo or the bistro is what it's saying. But it's, this gazebo is where he like streaked around. So go ahead and take that photo. And now let's just make sure that photo came out well. No, it did not. So we're gonna sell it, and we are gonna buy new. Or take new camera, take a photo. Okay. I just want to zoom out just a little bit. Maybe if we could get the whole thing, that'd be kind of cool. There we go. Alright, now let's see. Did that come out nice? No, it didn't. Oh my goodness. Take another one. <sighs> All right, come on, buddy. I've been taking photos for everything else and seem to be okay. All right, that looks really nice. Okay, can we actually name these photos? That was another thing I was curious about. View them. Like. Like, if I pull this into my inventory, right, can I name this? Oh my god, I can. Perfect. Alright, so this is going to be bucket list f number three. I'm going to put streaking night. Alright. I don't think I need night on there. I'll just do streaking because that's what it was. Perfect. So that one, and then we've got this one is number one, and this one is going to be number two. So this one, this is bucket list number one, watching a sunrise. Perfect. And then this is... Bucket list number two, um, playing an instrument. Alright, and these ones I'm just keeping, they're extras, I'm not, um, I don't, I'm not gonna, um, do anything really with them because they're not part of the challenge really I mean they were for we took them on the night but still alright I just want to harvest a little bit just like some salad maybe um, is there lettuce there's onions alright I know my time is about up but we may go a little bit over today bell peppers no looking for like a lettuce plant. Alright, harvest this. And then is there like some fruit 
fruit trees. I really want lime. I mean, apple or something would be good. I'm not really seeing much here at this garden. It's really dark for me, though. I'm having a hard time seeing it. Alright, a watermelon. Okay, it's not ready. I can harvest that one. What was this? Alright, watermelon. And... Alright, we're just going to harvest these three plants, and then I'm going to send him actually back home. So we might be a little longer than 30 minutes, because I know my timer was just about to go off. But I just wanted some things at the house so that we can make, like, pancakes or autumn salad or whatever when we wake up in the mornings and we don't always have to go out and eat. Now that we have money, does it really matter? Probably not, but that's okay. So bucket list number one, number two, and number three. Streaking in the garden. <laughs> that's literally it. And he finished his lifetime wish in this episode. And he won the lottery. Like, he's just killing it. Alright, I'm going to have you stop harvesting that one and go do these other ones. Um, I know he has, like, some pe or orange seeds here and some peach seeds here. So we are going to probably plant some of those. The rest of this, I don't really know what else I'm going to do with that. I don't, I don't think we can really use pecans. Probably not going to use the peppermint or the mighty, the midnight bean seeds and the mandrakes. I'm not really doing, um, um, I'm not really doing alchemy at the moment, so I'm not too worried about it, but this was definitely an eventful night, let me tell you. Mm. Alright, so we got some more lettuce, and then we're going to harvest this watermelon, and then we're going to head home. He is already tired, it is pretty late. Once I see it pretty much pop into the inventory, that's the only thing I gotta see, and then I can just cancel it out. Okay, there we go. And let's head home. I'm gonna get you back there. I'm gonna probably get him into bed, and we can mark number three off the list, because it is completed. It is so dark in this freaking place. I can barely see what's going on. But I'm really trying. I'm really trying. Alright, let's get back home. Alright, so I'm just going to throw these in the fridge for you. Alright, I don't know what he's all excited about, but something. So throw these in here. It's not much, but it's enough to have a couple meals at least. And then I'm going to have him go to bed, and when he gets up, obviously he always uses the bathroom, takes a shower, and then I think... We'll go ahead and we'll have breakfast. Um, I'm going to tell him to have... Oh, we need an egg to make waffles. Man. Alright, well, we can't make pancakes yet, but eventually we will be able to. Alright, guys, well, if you guys enjoyed this, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. In the description below, there is a donation link and all of my social media links, so definitely check this out. And please follow me on those, because it would really mean a lot. Like I said, the next one is probably going to be recorded, so I'm going to sound like this probably in the next episode as well. So I do apologize ahead of time, um, but I'm just trying to get them recorded so that I have stuff to post to you guys this week. Um, and then I'm obviously going to have to do Sims 4 as well. And I would like to throw probably one or two more LPs out there for you guys. Um, I, haven't said, I haven't thought about what I want to do yet. 
I don't want to get like a hundred, but like three or four is manageable where I could do at least like one episode a week. Um, and just like rotate through them. So if you guys have any suggestions for that, I would really appreciate it. Um, and yeah, let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. Please don't forget to, if you're new to hit that notification bell as well, if you would like to be notified when I post my videos and definitely share my stuff and help my channel grow. Cause I would really appreciate it. I would really like to be able to do this as a full-time job as like, you know, someday down the road. If not, obviously that's fine, but it's just like, you know, something I want to be able to say that I achieved. But anyways, guys, if you guys liked it, again, I apologize for how bad I probably sound in this because I probably sound horrible and I will talk to you guys in my very next one. Thanks very much for watching.